Shout out Sean Desmond's absolute classic banger called Electric. That shit was hot in like, I don't even know, like 2002? Five. Something like that. I don't know. That song is pretty old by now. Still bangs though. Still bangs heavy. And Mario Lopez is somehow like my local DJ. The radio here somehow, like he gets paid to record from multiple regions, I guess, and mine being one of them, but <laughs> you got AC Slater putting on Electric from Sean Desmond, who I think is originally a, like a Toronto or Mississauga native. He's a Southern Ontario boy. Anyhow, as you can see, your guys got the big box here. I just slung my uh, an old mattress in a sketchy part of town, but the lady was very nice. She was very, very normal, very cool, very chill. And uh, got a little 200 bucks for an old mat an old mattress. So we're coming up in the game, but uh, I'm finally trying this Popeyes. They have been putting it off for a long time here. I wanna try this uh, chicken sandwich. I've never tried this crazy famous Popeyes chicken sandwich. Probably get two sides, probably get mashed potatoes and a coleslaw, maybe some fries, sandwich, and see what this sandwich is really all about. All right, I'm going in because I'm not waiting in this lineup. This lineup's nuts. The sack is secured, but we're going to relocate to an alternate location. All right, the eagle has landed. That area was too hot to trot. I got to tell you, though, Popeyes, it's crushing it. Like, Popeyes is just a different level of fast food. Places really need to take, take notes. But what I got was the deluxe chicken sandwich right here in this bag. I got a cherry coke they got cherry coke on tap so shout out popeyes we have some cajun fries which their cajun fries are amaze balls we have red beans and rice we got mashed potatoes with gravy we got a conchlon and we got many <laughs> blackened ranch i got three blackened ranch because i probably keep a couple in the fridge if i don't use them all and then i got Tartar sauce and wild honey mustard. Tartar sauce for the fries a little bit. And then we're gonna douse the chicken sandwich in some of these sauces. So let's get into this and let's unveil the holy grail, which is this chicken sandwich. First time seeing it, we got a diaper. Got a nice diaper, nice bib. And oh my God, this looks actually incredible. Wow. Popeyes is really doing it bun's amazing lettuce is fresh that chicken looks amazing the pickles look amazing and uh that looks like one of the best chicken sandwiches i've ever seen in my life so it's as good as everybody says i i almost guarantee you open wide go to the dentist That's gonna require the wad of napkins from the back pocket. Okay, gotta get in deeper, but so far, so good. Mmm. Very fresh, very, very fresh. We gotta blacken it though with that ranch this no joke you guys is one of my favorite sauces of any fast food chain is this black and ranch from uh popeyes oh wow oh wow Mark Weens. Whoa. <laughs> that guy lives the Mark dream. Traveling and eating. Okay. That's a good chicken sandwich. 
I forgot how good Popeyes really is. I'm so glad that we have it. I'll be hitting it more, more often. My first time here since it's been, since it's open. All right. I'm intrigued to know what the honey mustard game is like. Starving here because I built up an appetite. After swimming, did like an hour lengths, and then I kicked it in the hot tub for a solid 30 minutes. <laughs> Very therapeutic though. Super happy about it because they finally lifted the mandate, like the vaccine passport mandate. They lifted in my province and uh, the masks come off in, I think it's eight days. Are no longer mandatory. So that's amazing. Thank you truckers. I don't think without them doing what they've done any of that would have happened. So we're on the cusp of returning back to some semblance of normalcy. And I'm so excited to just go places open faced. I just cannot wait to just breathe freely and not do this stupid shit anymore. I'm so done with it. As you can tell, that chicken sandwich is amazing because I couldn't stop eating it. It was just a uh, had to smash. These Cajun fries are the best. Some of the best fries, fast food wise as well. Very unique. Tartar sauce. Doesn't work as well as I thought it would. Still good though. She's getting steamy in here. Might need a little air. Ugh. Try that black and ranch on there. Mmm. That goes good on everything. I gotta say, nothing like a classic banger song to like teleport you back, like that Sean Desmond track. It was a hitter when it came out. Still good. Just that feeling when a good old track comes on. The head space it puts you in is awesome. However, <laughs> they redid, uh, they've been playing on the radio. It's like, is it fantasy or like Mariah Carey Juicy or whatever it is? But somebody remixed it and now it's called Big Dick Energy. So it's the, uh, I think the response to WAP, if you will. And I feel like they ruined it a little bit. Because that's a... Uh, Timeless classic bop by Mariah. And I don't think they should have put anything else on it. So they kind of ruined it. I'm not down. So good, these fries. Cherry Coke palate cleanse. So crisp. All right, sides. Something that I would never usually get, but I felt intrigued to do it today, is red beans and rice. I was debating the mac and cheese, but I've had the mac and cheese from here a bunch of times. And for some reason, it all it just seems to always fall short. Which is not that good. And surprisingly, 
The red beans and rice is really good. Very like savory, salty, a little bit of spice. Nice mouthfeel. Delicious. Classic dish. Home cooking. Mm. Felt good to get exercise. Step one. To getting a better lifestyle kick back into gear. Spring's coming. So we'll start swimming. Start walking. Be dope. It's so interesting, like going to the pool today, there's so many little ones there, like parents and kids. I, like, I never see kids, right? Like how, like when, I'm, when am I around children? Never. And then you see like, I just forget that they're these tiny little humans. They're like, and you can almost look at them and see like, you can like see them in 25 years. Like you can like see what they're gonna look like in the future in a sense. <laughs> but they're just like these little, I don't know, it's, re it's really weird. I just don't often see children, and then when I do, like it just trips me out. And they're so random and inquisitive and hilarious. And they love to stare. <laughs> I swear, kids always seem to like lock onto my eyes all the time they're like just like they like and i'm just like so i don't know what to do here how are you but you can't talk <laughs> they're mashed potatoes but well they're great well both but the gravy is exceptional but yeah a bunch of you have had kids and raised kids and I just haven't had any like nieces or nephews or really anything like that. So it's always a trip for me to like spend any portion of time around kids, but I do find them hilarious. They're, uh, they're, they're <laughs> fun to hang around with if they're not throwing a fit. If they do throw a fit, then it is what it is. They're kids. Do I love it? No. Is it a big deal to me? Also, no. Mm. Getting full. Last couple of Cajun fries. Man, the sauce is so good. That's something I wish I knew how to recreate at home. I have zero idea how they make this. All right, last but not least, actually like my favorite, one of my favorite things from Popeyes is their coleslaw. I'm pretty full though. I'm just gonna have a couple forkfuls to uh, just clean up the end of the palate here. Hopefully it's as good as I remember. Immediately, so. oh man, they're dressing. Oh, I forgot how good this is. Oh, it's probably my favorite thing from Popeyes. I'm not gonna lie. Got some serious uh, break and entry, breaking and entering. It sounds like over there. Man. All right. I'm gonna save. A little half for later when I'm back real hungry. I'm going to really enjoy that. So cold, crispy out the fridge. It's just their dressing. That's too perfect. It's the perfect balance. It's amazing. Inaugural Popeye's try. I need to do another meal, though, where I get, like, the chick. Uh, I'll probably get... I want to try their nuggets. Those are, like, new. I like their tenders a lot, but I also like their bone-in chicken, too, so... 
I already one of those videos too, but I needed to try the sandwich. The sandwich was, it, it is the, it's, it's the hype. I get why, I don't get why people like murdered each other for it two years ago and all that. And like waited in lines the size of two blocks and shit and like fought. It's not that good, but it's definitely like one of the best fast food chicken sandwiches. It's high quality. The batter is amazing. The chicken quality is amazing. Really good. So yeah, that sandwich gets like a, I don't know, like, yeah, like a 9 out of 10, like for real. Rest of it, obviously banging. They were out of sweet heat sauce. Don't know if I said that already, but I think I did. And that's a bummer because I love the sweet heat, but neither here nor there. Next time. Till then, you know what to do. Eat good, live well. Stay true.